Hey guys, welcome to Taurus 37 Day I'm reviewing this, which is the Marvel Legends series, um, Monster Venom Bath Wave Scream. So this is pretty cool. We got a nice square view of her in box. We have the Venom logo, Marvel Scream down here. We have the Venom symbol up here, Legend series, Monster Venom. Pretty neat artwork on the side. I just love this box that they've done, this new box style. It looks so cool. We got a bio up here. Pretty cool picture and the other characters variable. So yeah, let's open this up. So, here we have Scream, and um, if I'm not mistaken, I believe that when this character debuted in the comic books, uh, she didn't have a name. Well, I mean, she might have had, like, a human name, but I don't think she had, like, an alias, and I think, I might be wrong about this, but I believe that the company Toy Biz, when they released an action figure of her in the 90s, I think they were the ones who came up with her name, and then Marvel eventually integrated that into the comic book universe. Again, not 100% sure about that, but I think that's pretty cool, and uh, yeah, so here we have this character in the action figure format again and uh it's very nice i love the signs on the face it just looks so cool up here with the all black and then you can see the white eyes and the teeth it just looks amazing my favorite part about this has to be the hair though i love how they did this it's like gold and red and symbiotic and it just looks so cool to what we've seen it's just pretty neat pretty amazing and then with the hands you can see they're the kind of like claw hands I, these might be the same that come with carnage but i'm not completely sure about that either way they look really cool you can see these brown spots that go around her arms and the rest of her and it just looks pretty neat pretty cool it's kind of like this gold and yellow coloring really cool really nicely detailed and uh yeah just pretty awesome in terms of articulation you got a free 60 of the head you can look up and down it is a bit hindered by the hair but i don't mind that because the hair is pretty cool you have a free 60 at the arms again a little bit hindered by the hair there but still neat they swing out the shoulder free 60 there single jointed elbow but it does rotate as well there is a free 60 at the wrist but a little stiff it's on hinges 360 sort of at the torso the legs come forwards and backwards and outwards you have a 360 of the thigh double jointed knees and the feet are on ankle rockers so pretty good in terms of articulation i really love the detail on this one uh very cool very nice and again you know it's kind of nice to see this character being released again because again not 100 percent sure about her name but that's how the character got the name i at least i think that is so it's kind of cool to see this come back as an action figure and pretty cool so yeah thank you for watching please rate like and subscribe